you know, with the tele lens I've got on it, it should be entirely visible, the dark side of the moon, but I don't see anything. It's all entirely blue. Uh, especially after 9-11 that, you know, everything is a lie, you know, it's, it's so clear. Uh, maybe if I look at the monitor I can see something, but I don't think there's anything. And this light, they say this is the reflection of the sun, but the sun is out, you know. It's on the other side, so it should be shining on the moon entirely, but it doesn't. It's all a lie. And this light, you know, it's like an LED lamp, you know, it's shining so bright, you know, this is not the reflection of some sun, you know, in the night. It's something else. This is the only light, the only tunnel, it looks like a tunnel. This is the only tunnel that, you know, people have been describing with a near-death experience, you know, going in there. Uh, a, a tunnel, like opening up and closing down. I should have a look at the monitor. But this is a quite, you know, it's a good tele lens on it. Uh, it. It should perfectly show the dark side of the moon, but there isn't. Or maybe this one is the light, the heavens, the paradise where there's light. It's shining light, a lot of light, you know, like in the night, which is not the reflection of the sun, bull. Look, it's all blue on the other side. It has even been shown clouds on the other side of the moon. Now, and the, uh, the other planets around us, that's the fire. The fire of hell, probably. I mean, look, the light is here, the bright light, paradise, and the other one is the fire. This, this, is, this is what they've been talking about all these years, you know, isn't it? Hey, hey, hey. Here in the east of France, next to Besançon, there's a place called Dame Martin of the Templars. Dame Martin, le Templier. Tem Templier is the French word for Templars. This uh, building here is called the Temple, from the Templars. Here you can see the, uh, the Swiss cross, absolutely. And there in the window, as I filmed before, you know, the, um, the Freemason uh, skirts, as I showed in Gréoux le Bain, you know, with the, um, the Templars V in it. So this is a, temp uh, a Freemason Templars lodge, there's no doubt at all. Uh, here in Salin le Bain. Uh, here it says something about the Templars. Just pause it. So here, from this side, it looks more like a Templar's cross, of course. But it's, there you are. But it's the Swiss on a Templar, it's like on the Swiss army knife. It's even called Rue du Temple, the Templars, well, the Lodge of the Templars. And here it is. Old, it's very old. From the, uh, yeah, from the first crusades on. This is where they also, where they organized. And this place is very important because they found uh, salt here. Salin, Le Bain, that's where they, a lot of salt. So they got very rich also with this here, with the salt business. And again, the Freemasons are here. There's no doubt about that. So this was the Templar's Chapel here. And it's in very bad condition here. Uh, it's empty. So this is still a Freemason lodge, there's no doubt about that. You know, here's when they probably went up the stairs. And that's where the king was, you know, the first, the primogenitura, the first sons. There are two castles here, you know, enclosing the valley. And um, 
So while these guys were down in the village, you know, conspiring against the king quite openly, uh, well, not entirely openly, well, the cross is too small, the Templar's cross. So here was the Templar's cross here, and this is the building. So just under his nose, they were conspiring. And this is not very far from that other town uh, called uh, Dam Martin of the Templars. Uh, but there wasn't very much more to see there. Uh, next to here, there's also a Jesuit chapel. I'm going to have a look at it now. And of course, the curtains are like in a V form of the Templars. And it's red and white for the United Kingdom of Pharaoh. Red and white, as always. I don't know what that means, it's only red. Well, red are actually the, uh, it's uh, Lower Egypt and there are fewer of them. They are the first sons. So one night later, the same moon, it's midnight, there's no sun and they say, well, it's the sun shining on it. Well, there's a completely different angle now, there's no sun at all, but it's still the same. Before the sun was in a different angle, it was just, was in the sky, now there's no sun. So how come it's still the same crescent moon or half moon? It says this is a Jesuit church in uh, Salin Laban. Oh, you can read it. It doesn't say very much in English. Eglise Notre Dame. So there you go. This is a Jesuit church. This is place is really a stronghold of uh, evil. You know the Templars, and, you know Freemasons very rich because of the salt which was the gold of like of the middle ages the gold you know and uh oh, yes yeah, jesuit shows and as you know the jesuits they were assigned you know to there's even the uh, the sun hieroglyph here the jesuits were assigned you know by the pope to kill all the protestants to get rid of them the guys who uh, you know who really looked into the Bible and what it is, you know. So this is the other castle enclosing the valley with another king, you know. While downtown the uh, the Freemasons, uh, like the Templars, they were all like conspiring against them. And this is another f Jesuit chapel just right next to the other one. The other one is there, you know. You see the church here. That's the Templars church. And this is another Templars. Uh, sorry, a, um, a Jesuit church, and this is another Jesuit chapel, it says. Uh, let's have a closer look. Real, it's an evil place here in the northeast of France, but the people are quite nice. Yeah, it says the Jesuits came here in 1623, so that's five years after the beginning of the Thirty Year War, where Swiss mercenaries killed, you know, like uh, two thirds of the German population. So this is in the northeast of uh, France. It's not very far from Switzerland. There's a lot of Swiss, you know, buying houses here and properties here. So that's the old Jesuit door. You know, real evil guys. Uh, this is the whole building here. It's, it's all very old here. So d d just think of the Pope's guard, you know, of the Vatican. There's all Swiss. So probably crawling with Swiss here in those days, you know. Again, the Templars Chapel. This is placed in the northeast of France, not very far from Switzerland. Really is a stronghold of Templars, Jesuits. They hit the, the two Jesuit churches next to each other. The Freemasons still are there. You could see that on the curtains. Um, a very important place, and it's crawling with Swiss anyway. Uh, very near to the Swiss border, yeah, as always. <laughs> no, 
you know. What a weird statue also in Salin Le Bain, the Pope with sort of an extraterrestrial ear. Hey man man man. What happened to humanity, eh? Yeah, still the castle here. Oh. One lord on this side here and another lord on the other side. And in the middle here is the town. It seems like there's nothing on the dark side of the moon. Absolutely nothing. Well, there's nothing on the other side of the dark side of the moon. There's nothing. I got a big tele lens on it. After 9 11, oh, today it is 9 11, in fact, uh, 2016. Well, we know it's all a lie. They lie about everything, and we are their slaves. That's why you have a personal slave number, you know, on your passport, anything, and there is a, con a control of the. Um, the Knights of the King, you know, they, you have to show it, you know, and they put a bloody chip in it, which is would grill it like in a microwave. Uh, yeah. So this is a map of um, this is the place Salin Le Bain. So this is the other castle on the hill, and here is this castle here, number ten. You see, number ten, and here it says number ten. It's owned privately. Hmm. Uh, somewhere there. Uh, there it is. Private, privé. So, what is Pharaoh doing there, you know? There he is. With the Freemason Lodge. Here, look, look at the bridge here. You, know? you never get in here. So what are they doing here? You know, with the Freemason Lodge below, an old Templar's reunion place, you know, for children. They always did this, you know, with children and torturing us, these pharaohs and the arist who became the aristocracy. They are the ones who have always been doing this and they continue to do so. And on top of it, you can see the... Uh, the pharaonic flag, blue, uh, red, white and blue. The pharaonic colors, red and white of the United Kingdom and blue for the war. And they're up, to, up for war now. Everywhere you see the, uh, uh, the, um, the French flag everywhere. There's a war coming up. Concentration camps put the Muslims in there this time. Look, it looks like a Freemason lodge here. What a weird place, man. This is an entrance of a house here. What a weird place. What is this, man? Okay. When there is a lot of rain, En fait, l'eau elle arrive jusqu'ici, jusqu'au travers qu'on voit tout le long. Et au fait, à ce niveau-là, à un niveau d'ici, l'eau elle s'arrête, elle, elle ouvre comme ça. Il y a quoi 2-3 cm d'eau pas plus. Alors ici, ils ont lavé les cadavres. Ici, oui, ils lavaient les cadavres, les cadavres dans le temps. Et puis en fait, les caves ici, c'était où ils ont placé les morts en fait. So here we're next to the uh, the Templars place here and they used to wash the bodies here in, the, in this water here and the guy says when it rains a lot the water gets all the way to the uh, to here but funny enough it it gets very high but it doesn't it doesn't go to the other caves here it just stops here which is like mm, impossible to uh, to understand it's it's so the water gets that high so logically it would you know would get everywhere 
So in this house there's a lot of drug addicts and a lot of, he's one of them, and uh, next to the Templars. And, and I mean, they make all the money with it, you know, they, they give uh, a social security to the, uh, the drug addicts so they can um, exploit the, the drugs coming from Afghanistan and uh, which the Taliban actually, uh, um, they forbid it. Yeah. Okay, merci. Très intéressant. Well, you can clearly see the cloud is behind the moon. The moon is, I don't know, what is it, 100,000 kilometers away or a million kilometers. And the cloud is behind there? Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> Look at that, the cloud is behind the moon. Everything is a lie. Yeah. Look, there's a village here. I'm, I'm, I'm not joking. 